am I in the middle? Oh, yeah. So, hi guys, welcome to my channel. I know you miss me, I miss you too. <laughs> so, the purpose of this whole video, I've not been on YouTube for a very long time, right? I'm tired of saying sorry. I'm not going to say sorry because I might go off again after this one. But the thing as you get money, you enjoy, you go rich. So, I have new pots. <laughs> Let me bring them out. <laughs> Did you know? Hey, don't put your hand in there. Did you know? Okay, so a lot of people know this, and I do not know. And don't crucify me. Did you know about these induction pots? First of all, there is something called induction hubs. Let me show you guys. Induction burner. So we had one already, but it got bad. I'm cooking, that's why everybody is a mess. It ha we had one, it got bad, and then the landlord changed it to this induction hub, right? These sheets, this thing they call induction hub. Listen, if I put this on, right? This one is on right now. I put my hand on it. It's not burning. It's not burning, but if you put the pot on it, it starts to work. But it has to also be an induction pot, if not, it's not mad, man, mad. Outside is cold, though. The sun is just shining. It's cold. The sun is just shining. Shining for shining sake. You want to braid? Who braid for you? She can't go. But I know somebody that brought it for another friend of mine that have visited. And she did it 50 pounds, so it was cheaper than my girl. The cheaper the better. <laughs> you don't know what my mom is? Yes. Who feeds my mom in this house? I thought of, I thought of that. What do you do for my mom? Bean you cake. Know? Abby? And they call it bean cake. Do you mean that my mom? Yeah, it's made of beans. It's made of beans? Yeah, I didn't make my mom before. I have a bowl. She has eaten moe moe in this house. I don't mind that. This... When? When? You've eaten moe moe in ten years. I've made moe moe in this house. Okay. Tell probably, me. You probably did not hear the name. So you've had moe moe. Whatever moe moe is, I don't know. Oh my gosh. Can you have moe moe? It's made of beans. But the difference is it's blended. I think I might remember now. It's blended. Do you mean that's um brown beans I eat? Yes, the brown beans. What? But how is it called moi moi moi? How do you call it Nigeria? Moi moi. Moi moi. How's it called what? What do you call it? Beans. No, what what do you call moi moi? Pronounce moi moi like that. Say it. What did you say? Say moi moi. Moi moi. Uh -huh. No, it's But we call it Beans. Yeah, but when it's blended like that, mommy, I thought you said you only need two. No, this last one, I need four. You need what? I need four. I'm only four now. Oh my god, can we just pause?
Why is that? Why And I'm going to upload it on my vlog. It's going to see the vlog. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I like chocolate. But really, why is that men don't like it? Men don't like it when you put on your clothes. And it fits. Yeah, as in, it's free and you know, mm -hmm, just <laughs> to swallow you. But guess what? If you want to go and buy an outfit for yourself, you don't buy it. You don't buy it big. Uh, you buy fitted. Mm. I will not make you break. Then, what is that? Two have become one. For better or for worse. So guys, I just um, I just got, or well, I just left the venue for her party. I'll insert a video of, you know how, how the place looks and everything. She doesn't know I'm doing all of this and I've not mentioned anything to her and I don't intend to mention anything to her because you know how kids can be once she knows that something is going on she's going to be on the edge and asking me questions and disturbing me and today's date is the... what's today? Today's the 5th so from the 5th her birthday is actually on the 19th of October but I can't really do anything on that 19th because when I tried to book the venue they said because the week that week is the half term week and because it's a half term week, a lot of kids will be using the place so they cannot like do like a birthday party because they will probably restrict the number of other kids that can come there to play and they don't want to do that. Anywho, so um, I ended up, they ended up giving me a date for the weekend, the 21st. So she's going to do on the 21st, meaning um, from the 5th to the 21st is a long time. I don't want anybody bugging me from now to the 21st. So I'm not telling her anything. I went ahead. I've booked the place now. I got my invites. And the invite is very, very self-explanatory. Really self-explanatory, to be honest. Give them out to her friends' parents without them telling their kids and the kids not telling her. If that makes any sense. Because at this point, we have to do top secrets when it comes to these things. Because these kids, hmm, pester your life. So, I'm glad I got that out of the way. I've ordered for her dress as well. I should have ordered for the dress earlier than now, I know. But she's been saying she wanted a frozen theme party. Now that I'm using an indoor play area for the party, I can't really decorate the place. I didn't even ask if I could. Oh yeah, I did. I can't really decorate the place. And it doesn't make any sense for me to choose to decorate the place now and buy a lot of props decorate the place and after the birthday what happens money don't go so i'm not doing that anyway so instead of doing like a theme party like she wanted i just thought it would make more sense to get her like a frozen outfit so she can appear to the party dressed in her frozen outfit so now this is the tricky part i got the frozen outfit um the frozen dress yeah, the frozen outfit but it's a it's an indoor play park like it's a park but it's an indoor play park that has like soft play areas and stuff she cannot be playing with her dress so i ordered a like a casual jumpsuit that she can you know wear and play around with so if she's using that i don't know she will she not have to wear her frozen dress quite noisy sorry guys Will she have to wear her frozen dress before the play or after the play? Because after the play, there, see, it's a bit confusing right now. I'll figure it out. Anyhow, so just a quick update on the venue. Venue lockdown. <clears throat> Last year, we did not do anything for Tony because she didn't really have too many friends. We're just, no, we didn't just get here, but I was still trying to settle in. It didn't make any sense for me to do anything. And I spoke to her and explained to her that, you know, see... Um, this is what's happening and this is why we're not doing anything and she understood she was quite understanding and she said okay it's fine i understand but i had to promise her that the following year which is this year i was going to do something for her so she was like oh it's fine it's fine so since the beginning of the year since 2023 she has been looking forward to this birthday especially because now she's more settled she's in year two she has friends 
we're a bit more settled let me just put it that way so she's been counting down literally when we got to october are we in october yeah we're in october so i'm glad i'm doing this so i'm glad we're doing this for her so it's like a win-win and it's not too far from my house um i don't need to when on the day off it won't be a hassle finding this place because it's not far from the house at all my house is relatively close to everywhere i need to go because i just walk everywhere so i don't even have a car and i don't need a car at the moment so yeah oh my bus is here talk to you guys later that's my bus coming wait i don't know or maybe the sense so and not everything oh did you buy for dj too no i didn't buy for dj Why? it's not his birthday you know, wear his old clothes. <laughs> but I bought for myself. <laughs> yeah, I, you know kids, they will wear their clothes fast now. So what's the point? Uh, okay, okay. I thought you were going to bring my package. So I unbox it here. I don't even know what came. Like, um, some people will say, you know, it's when they get home and they take their shoes off after a long day's shift or a long, long day's work or whatever. And to me, the best feeling, aside taking off your bra when you get home as a woman, the next best feeling is when you take off that wig. Yo! You see, when you just take it off. I'll take next steps. So, I want to cook lunch now. I'm the type of person that when I go to the market with the intention of buying one A, B, C, and I see X, Y, Z that to me feels better than A, B, C, I'll go for X, Y, Z. I rarely follow my list. I made a list. I was going to get fruits. I went to the market and I saw lots of fruits that attracted me to the market. I ended up getting something else for lunch. Now, I had to pick lunch right now. It's more important than fruits. So. I'll get the first later because I'm still going out in a few minutes. So I saw this fruit market very close to where I went to um, the hall, the play, indoor play area where Tenny will be doing her birthday. I was like, nah, I'm gonna get these things. I got cabbage, I got chicken, I got peppers. So I want to do like cabbage sauce and we'll have a rice. And then I got onions, lots of it. That's basically it. Um, I'll probably record while I'm making it or maybe when I'm done. I don't know.